Hi friends, today we are gonna continue on with subtraction. And subtraction is when we take a bigger number and we take away and we'll have a smaller number. All right, so on our first Go Math page, we have seven counters. And I know you probably do not have counters at home. That's okay. We can always draw circles. All right, so we have seven. And it says to take away, there's that minus sign, take away two. So when I'm using a 10 frame, I will cross off how many I'm taking away. So I have seven, let's count, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I have seven in all, and it says, away. It says to take away two. So I'm gonna take away two counters, and when I subtract, I like to cross off. That way I know how many are left. So let's count how many are left. One, two, three, four, five. So seven, take away two. Seven minus two equals five. All right, let's do another one together. And again, on this page, I kind of started this one for you. It's okay to draw circles because I know you probably don't have the counters at home. You could use coins. That would work for counters or m and m something like that. So, so I'm gonna draw my 10 frame. Now, I like to make pictures like we did with addition when I'm subtracting two. So I have eight circles, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it says eight and it says minus, I'm taking away, this is how many I'm taking away, one. How many are left? Well, let's see. So it says eight, make sure I've got eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I'm gonna take one away. So I'm gonna cross off one, zap. I like to say, take it away, zap. Zap him away. And how many are left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So eight minus one, or eight take away one, equals seven. All right, friends, I'll let you get busy on your Go Math pages today. Good job.